going on, everybody? Welcome back to the 2020 Ultimate DI Preamp Shootout Showcase. It's been a while, and today is matchup number f five. In all seriousness, today's matchup was supposed to be between the Orange Base Butler and the Tech 21 DI 2112. However, unfortunately, due to COVID-19, production on the DI-2112 has been delayed, meaning it's not going to ship to me until sometime around late June of this year. So if you're watching this video upon release, we got about another month and a half to two months to go before that video is ready. But if you're watching it in the future, all's good, nothing to worry about. The video is probably done and over there in the recommended section. So I think it goes without saying that we're going to switch it around a little bit and matchup number five of round one is between the TC Electronic Spectra Drive and the Hartkey Base Attack 2. Like everything we've seen in round one up to this point, we're just getting a general acquaintance with each pedal and getting a better idea of how each one sounds. So we're going to start by hearing the gain stage. I've got three tones dialed up, each at the 9, 12, and 3 o'clock positions. So let's take a look at that. to turn the drive off and get a better understanding of the EQ capabilities. The Spectra drive has a four band EQ where the base attack has a three band EQ with a semi parametric mid range. And now let's check out some of their differences. First off, the heart key has a tone control. Now, I'm pretty sure you already know what a tone control is and how it works, so let's just go straight into checking out how it sounds. Thank you. 
The Spectra Drive also has a couple of tricks up its sleeve, the first of which being it has a built-in SpectraComp compressor. feature of the Spectra Drive's drive section is that it utilizes tone print. Now up to this point we've been using the same tone print setting. I forget exactly which one it was, but it was the one that I felt best matched the sound of the heart key. So now what we're going to do is just cycle through every different tone print for the drive stage of the Spectra Drive. Finally, to wrap things up, I have set a tone on the heart key that I think sounds good, and I have set the Spectra Drive's knobs to match. Again, going the other way, I have set a tone on the Spectra Drive that I think sounds good, and I've set the heart keys knobs to match. And that just about wraps up matchup number five of round one of our 2020 DI preamp shootout. Again, like I said before, the next episode should be coming sometime around July. Again, I'm just waiting for the pedal to get to me so I can shoot it and edit it and upload it and release it to you guys. So if you want to be notified of when that happens, make sure you hit subscribe and click the notification bell. You can also check out Patreon for more exclusive content. And right about here, YouTube is going to recommend a video that they think you're going to enjoy the most out of everything we have to offer. So until next time, I'm Chris from the Bass Channel, and thanks for watching.